folks, how are you today? This is Jim Miner, your South Scottsdale real estate agent, known as the Garage Office Real Estate Agent. Hey, I want to talk to you about a couple things today in my exquisite office. It's warm, summer, wow. And it, whose idea was this? Um, talk to you about your moving and whether you're buyer or seller. And all of us have, most of us have pets, dog or cat, typically. And one of the things we want to do is try and minimize the disruption in their lives because it's going to make things a lot smoother for the family, for the pet. And there are things that we need to consider. First off, when we're getting ready to, let's talk to the seller, we're getting ready to pack up the house. If you have somebody that's, you know, a friend or the grandparents, somebody like that, that the dog or cat has stayed with before, you might want to have them stay during that period of time because when you start moving things out of that house, you know, they're going to get a little shook up. And also, if they're not there temporarily, is it allows you to get things done a little bit quicker and a little bit faster. You also want to be thinking about the mode of transportation. Are they going to be in the cage? Are they going to be in the car? Are they going to be in the truck? Is it a U-Haul? Are you flying? Things of that nature. How exactly is that animal being transported? In addition to the food. You want to minimize changes in their lives. You don't want to start changing food, you know, the water, keep the bowls that they eat out of the same along the trip, obviously, if possible. Do they have shots? What's it going to be like on the other end? You drive up in the U-Haul, the pet's sitting there, you're at your house, and hey, we're excited, we're going to move in, this is great, and guess what? You don't have the keys yet. You've got to stay at the hotel. Is it pet friendly? Have you checked that out in advance? Because there are a lot of balls you got going in the air here. And, you, and those are some of the things you want to make sure you've touched on. Does another state have different kinds of shots that your pet is supposed to have? You can go to Petco, these places, and get that taken care of. And that's going to help to minimize things. But you know what, folks? One of the things I want to do at the end of this video, I'm going to attach an infograph. It's a nice little simple list of things that you can remember to do with and for your pet. I think you'll like it. We sure have liked it because pets are an important part of our life and we want to make sure that you know we minimize the disruption to them. So that's your tips and tricks and a little bit of advice and help for today from the garage office real estate agent from South Scottsdale, Jim Miner. Hey, you want to give me a call? 602-345-0433. We do accept text. See you on the next video.